Making a coffee in a different way, we're gonna do it with butter and egg yolks. So in a mason jar, plonk. We've now got two egg yolks, that's the start of it. We've got some melt, slightly melted butter and some salt and some hot water. And we're going to make a coffee. And uh, I will drink it and tell you whether I like it. In goes the butter, like I say, slightly, slightly melted. That's the butter. And then we're gonna add some salt into the mason jar. The reason we're using the mason jar purely is because the mixer, um, we can't find the bit that you normally put this stuff into. So it's not to look all trendy, I can assure you. Next, we're gonna get a whizzer, a hand whizzer, and also then get some hot boiled water into the mixture. And this is a replacement drink for coffee. It's going to be frothy, and creamy, I guess. A little bit salty. I have no idea what this is going to be like. No idea whatsoever. So Coat Cherish is the one to thank for this. A fatty latte. So it's butter, a couple of egg yolks, and some salt. No idea what this is going to taste like. Probably a bit too hot at the moment for me. I'm going to have it in a couple of minutes. Good news about the fatty latte was it was really nice and we're gonna add, but I hope Coach Cherish doesn't want a little bit of vanilla essence. A little bit of vanilla to see if that's fatty latte. Years ago when I was high carb sort of person going into Starbucks, I used to have vanilla syrup. Oh my word, terrible. Anyway, it's lovely without the vanilla. I'll tell you what it's like with the vanilla in a second. So I'm gonna do it now actually. Uh, I'll leave you with a little picture of the vanilla we're using. Mm. Oh man, that is perfect. That's brilliant. 